Hello guys, let me introduce myself. My name is Anis Aisha and I'm from class 3A. So today I would like to do presentation about fake news in our today's social media. Okay, but before we go to the main problems, which is fake news in social media, do you know what is fake news exactly mean? Okay, let me tell you. So, fake news is a false or misleading information presented as news, articles, or other items and intended to manipulate the viewer. Usually, fake news is made to, provo to provocate many people to dislike a person, organization, or etc. Uh, so, why fake news widely spread through social media? Because as we know, Nowadays, no one doesn't have social media. Okay, maybe just few people who doesn't have, but almost all people have social media like Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Facebook, and etc. Because in fact, social media can make our life easier. For example, we can talk to people in whole world by just by using social media. So that's why fake news widely spread through social media because everyone can do anything with their own social media, even sharing fake news. Fake news, sorry. But as a social media user and a good citizen, of course, we must be able to prevent spread of fake news on social media. There are several ways that we can do to prevent the spread of fake news. Okay, for the first is be careful with provocative titles. Usually, news that are posted on social media have titles that provoke us to be interested in reading and are usually persuasive. The purpose is to just one party. Okay, so if we if we find a title that is seems like provocative, we must we must read all the news first and also examine the contents of the news whether the news fake or true. Okay, for the second is pay attention to the site address. Usually fake news come from sites that have no clear source. So if we find news that is quite controversial, we must check the search first whether the search can be accounted for or not and the third one is check the facts and for the next one is join an anti-hoax group hoax group for the prevent the spread of fake news we can join an anti-hoax hoax groups so that we can know the news spread on social media is fake news or true but this is optional if you don't want to join that's fine but better if you join okay we go to the last one okay for the last tips is check the authenticity of the photos a lot of fake news that uses photos that are not not they are not original too for example when there was a tsunami disaster in 2018 a lot of fake news was found that used old photos one of my tips to check the authenticity of photos is check by using google lens so the conclusion for today's presentation is as a good social media users we must always examine what news that we get from social media because as we know today there is a lot of fake news that is spread through social media less we become intermediaries for Iran's possible people who want to spread it okay maybe that's all for me I hope you can take advantages from what I have said and thank you for watching bye guys